Brexit critic and MEP Philippe Lamberts has issued a damning verdict on the UK's prospects post-Brexit and government claims about the COVID-19 vaccine, telling Express.co.uk that Boris Johnson and co. still think Britain is an empire. Mr. Lambert slammed the government's claims this week that Brexit helped the country attain the coronavirus vaccine quicker than it would have done in the EU. Health Secretary Matt Hancock said, because of Brexit we've been able to make a decision, to approve the Pfizer vaccine, based in the UK regulator, a world-class regulator, and not go at the pace of the Europeans who are moving a little bit more slowly. We do all the same safety checks and the same processes, but we've been able to speed up how they're done because of Brexit. The claim, echoed by other ministers, appears to be false. During the Brexit transition period, the UK remains subject to EU rules and regulations. While vaccines are meant to be authorized by the European Medicines Agency, EMA, the UK is free to give approval for medicines such as the COVID vaccine during health crises, such as a pandemic. Mr. Lamberts, a Belgian MEP and co-president of the Greens in the European Parliament, tells Express.co.uk this is spin from the government in the UK. He said, I understand the Brexiteers need some positive spin, but frankly there won't be a difference between the deployment of the vaccine in the UK and the deployment of the vaccine in Europe. If they want to spin the issue, fine by me, but that is not the issue because in such circumstances you may go faster. Mr. Lamberts argued that the UK will lose influence outside the EU. He continued, I can recognize some people in the UK think the good old days of the empire can come back, and that Britannia can rule again. But this is over. The British people will soon realize they only represent 1% of the world population, and no, they don't have an empire any longer. The only way to have influence is to be a part of something bigger, that is, question, not if you can approve a vaccine three days quicker. Mr. Lamberts also issued a pessimistic prediction for the UK's status outside the EU.